What's going on gamers? It's Roll Easy here. Hope everyone is having a good Tuesday so far. Guys, we have a workaround for the gift cards to friends glitch. It was recently patched the way to get the car in, but we have a new method and I'm going to explain it to you here. For those of you that don't understand why and how this is a money glitch, the car is duplicating. Your friend's car is duplicating. So if you want to use this as a money glitch, tell him or her to use a retro or a Benny's vehicle that you can duplicate so you can make money off of. But make sure that you change the plate on it after you get the car or else the cars can be dirty okay so just it's good practice to make sure you always change the plate all right so for those of you that have never done this you need two friends and mocs with a free elegy in your personal vehicle storage and a good tip is for all of you to own the same bunker now in this video we're going to have three people the car receiver the guy getting the car the friend one who's getting guns in the bunker and friend two who is giving the car Okay, so we're gonna get started right here with the guy getting guns in the bunker. Okay, so friend one getting guns in the bunker on Xbox. You want friend two to jump into a job outside with his car, jump into a job real quick. Now, tell friend two to spam you some invites, okay, on Xbox. We're doing this on Xbox. Spam you like three invites. So right now, he spammed me three invites. I'm accepting one, I accepted another one holding the Xbox button, and I accepted another one while I got into the blue circle. Now, I got the alert, I press A to accept it, I tell him to back out of the job, all right? Now that he's backed out of the job, I get that message, it's gonna shoot me right back down, and now I have guns in the bunker. Everything should show up disappeared like that, like no MOC, no cars, no nothing, and that's how you wanna see it, okay? So at this point, the guy getting guns in the bunker, which is friend one, you'd go ahead and place two sticky bombs over to this area okay right where the light is in front of the light where the, behind the moc would be okay so you see right here is your positioning for the sticky bombs throw two there there you go you can throw the sticky bombs whenever but i just wanted to show you okay so now now that you have your friend glitched out in the bunker he can stay glitched out while the other two friends uh keep duping cars for each other okay but now we're back at the person getting the car all right this is kind of like the old sultan glitch the way that you have to do this but it's really simple okay so this is what you do. You go into your MOC, where you have your free allergy. This is the person getting the car, okay? Now, what you wanna do when the car starts, flick right trigger and let go of pause. So hold pause before you get in there, flick right trigger and let go of pause. And you should end up at this screen right here. Now, friend two, right now, you're waiting at this screen. So friend two in the top right, you want him to go ahead and jump into a Titan of a job. Any job will work, but jump into a Titan of a job. Remember, friend two is the one giving you the car. So friend, uh, so the guy, the guy receiving the car on the main screen is waiting right now. So once friend two right there is in a Titan of a job waiting, you go ahead and the person receiving the car, go ahead and join him through the friends tab or the, the Xbox dashboard, it doesn't matter. Go ahead and join him. You want to fully join into that game. Okay. This is the new way to get uh, the vehicle inside the bunker. The old way was patched. So we must do it this way. Okay, so like I said, friend two, outside, the guy giving the car needs to start up a job so that the guy receiving the car inside his MOC, inside his elegy, can do this part. So now, once you're fully in the job in the setting screen, go ahead and back out, all right? So once you're backed out, because you were inside of your bunker, you're going to end up at the docks. Now, what you want to do is sign out as whatever you were, make sure you're a CEO, and go ahead and request a buzzard, all right? You can go ahead and request your buzzard, nice and simple. And uh, when you request your buzzard, you're going to go ahead and fly it back to the bunker. Okay, this part is pretty chill. I recommend doing it this way so your friend has enough time to do his business. So friend two is still in the top right. All right, the guy receiving the car is the one in the buzzard. He's going back. Now, friend two, you're going to tell your friend two what car you want. You know, your retro, your whatever modded car, whatever you guys want. So friend two right now, while the car receiver is, dry, is uh, flying over to the bunker, Friend two in the top right is actually calling up the mechanic and getting the car for friend uh, for for the guy receiving the car. So friend two right now is going to go ahead and grab the car. In my case, friend two right here is giving an FMJ. So this modded FMJ right here. Now, the person giving the car, friend two, what you want to do is actually take off the door. This will make it much easier for your friend to get glitched out. So go ahead and hop out of the car, spam Y, you know, and then spam Y again to get back in. He won't, and right away hold left trigger, and then boom, run it into a tree, a pole, whatever you want, take off the door. That will make it nice and simple for the car receiver to get the car. So friend two, in the top right, go ahead and open up your interaction menu before you get to the yellow circle, and then park it right next to that yellow circle. Keep your interaction menu open while you're walking away so you don't get sucked in. 
you can close it once you're far enough away and check the positioning. You want it to pretty much be right at the doorway. At this positioning, I felt like I kind of pulled forward a bit too much. So I'm going to open up my interaction menu again, and I'm going to walk up to it, press Y to get in the car, and I'm just going to back it up just a bit. But you see the car receiver, he's still flying over right now. So get out of the car again, friend two. Uh, make sure your interaction menu is still up. And now you see that's a good positioning for the car. So we're back to the person receiving the car. Now we're back at the bunker, you know, we're ready to get the car. Now I am getting this car right here. You see, he set up the car for me already. So shout out to Butters and Wise for being awesome last night, you know, and helping me out making this video. Run towards the car and spam Y. Right before you get to that, or right as you get to that yellow circle, spam Y. If you get sucked in without the car, you do have to get re-glitched out again, meaning you gotta do the, the little trick, the Sultan uh, glitch trick, and you gotta fly all the way back again, okay? But if you hit it right, this is what you should see. You spawn in the bunker with the car that you're receiving. This is not yet my personal vehicle. My friend too is giving me this car. So what you wanna do now is just kinda position it, you know, right by the door, cause this is where we're gonna be getting sucked into the MOC in a few steps. So. Now that we're at this point, what we're gonna do is, as the car receiver, go back outside. Remember, the main screen here is the car receiver. Okay, so, now once I'm heading outside, remember, we had that free elegy inside of the MOC. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and go to the MOC menu, and we're gonna request personal vehicle. Now, when you request personal vehicle, what's gonna happen is the elegy is gonna spawn uh, down there. Now you can do two things. In this video, for some reason, my friend too was kind of glitched out so it didn't let us drive into the bunker together. But every other scenario, we were able to drive in together. So I recommend just going in together, it's fine. If you don't want to go in together, you can go in by yourself and then shoot him an invite. But you see, this is what happened. So he ended up getting in the elegy and then remember, he's giving me that car that's inside the bunker right now. But you see, it wasn't letting me in. So we simply just backed up and then he got out of the car and then I was able to actually go inside. But normally you will both be able to go inside. All right, so in this scenario, I'm just gonna fast forward a bit so it doesn't take way too long. Now I'm inside my bunker with the free elegy. Okay, this is the one we're gonna get all glitched out and stuff. Now, what you're gonna do is position it just to get right on the D-pad. You wanna be a little far away from those stickies. So now at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and invite my friend too, the guy giving me that purple car right there into my bunker. So, friend two is in the top right. All he's gonna do is sign in as a CEO and hover over retire, just hover over it. Now, you, t you press around on the D-pad as the car receiver to get frozen. You tell friend one, guns in the bunkers, to blow up the sticky bombs. There you go, the, the MOC has blown up. You're frozen here as the guy getting the car. So what you wanna do now is to, make the, to keep this as a three player glitch and not make the vehicle disappear, you want to go ahead and tell friend one, you see that guy right there throwing more stickies, you want to tell him, guns in the bunker, which is in the top right right now, friend one, to go ahead and hop in the vehicle that you want to be receiving so it doesn't disappear. The reason it might disappear is because friend two, the guy giving you the car, is actually going to be starting a job, okay? He needs to start a job to get you unglitched here. So friend two right now, you want to tell the guy that was in the elegy with you, go ahead and start up Titan of a job, okay? Simple as that. Go ahead and start up tighten up a job and then let you know when you're in when he's in the job now once friend two has uh, has gone into tighten up a job and he's just sitting in there you're gonna go ahead and press start or you can go to the gamer card you know on the xbox dashboard and you can join him this is the last timing part but it's not crazy crucial timing or anything but you do want to hurry up when it comes to this okay so here we go i'm gonna join him i'm at the alert tell him to back out right now okay you don't want to sit at the alert too long or you'll get booted to story so once he's back down and he's on the ground, you can go ahead and accept all the alerts. Just spam A and accept all the alerts. You should spawn right back down with the elegy, okay? And now you can get out of the car because you're unfrozen, all right? So now friend one can get out of the uh, the car that he was holding there for you so it didn't despawn. And this is the end of the glitch right here, basically. So right now I'm telling a friend one of the bunkers you can get out of the car. And then now I can go ahead and drive it into the left corner or right corner and it'll suck me into my MOC. And there we go. I got that card just like that. So it's just a few little tweaks and everything. If you're a little confused, go watch the, the other Gift Hearts to Friends glitch video that I did post. I'll leave it at the end of the video just so you guys can see how it was done before. I, I kind of did explain it a little bit differently because it was a different type of glitch, but only a few steps have changed. So now at this point, this part's the same. Once you've gotten your car and you're in your MOC, go ahead and go to Creator. If you try to exit at all, you're going to get stuck in an infinite black loading screen. 
So go ahead and just end up going to Creator. And uh, once you're in Creator, you can actually press start and you can join back on Friend2, the guy that was giving you the car. All right, that's what we did to just keep going back and forth. So we kept Friend1, Guns in the Bunker, we kept him glitched out for hours. A so huge shout out to Wise for being glitched out for like four hours while we were trading. And uh, yeah, so now I'm joining back onto my friend too, the guy that was giving me the car. And now I'm gonna end up going right back to that session. And it's as simple as that. Now that I'm back in that session, I'm gonna proceed to call out the car that he wants and then I'm gonna give him a car. And we just kept going back and forth, back and forth. And we got a lot of cars done last night, guys. I, we got nine cars a piece last night in a few hours. So definitely, definitely worth it. Really cool mod of cars. You can use this for a money glitch. Remember, change the plates. I will be coming out soon, maybe in a few days, maybe today, tomorrow, who knows, but sometime this week, a method to clean dirty dupes, okay? Because I know a lot of you have, clean, have dirty dupes and you need to clean them. I will try to come out with a method to clean dirty dupes. But at this point, like I said, you can go ahead and you can help your friend now. Go outside and call up a car that he wants and then you can help him out. All right, so that's gonna be it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys learned something. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure to like the video by hitting that blue thumbs up. Comment down below and subscribe by hitting the big red button if you are new and turn on them post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Peace out everybody. Have a good day.